students, highly educated, and in the 108th Cincinnati Police Recruit class, a record number have family members in law enforcement. They've spent more than a thousand hours training. Local 12's Deborah Dixon introduces you to some of the faces you'll soon see in the neighborhood. This is the day where you become part of the CPD family. Badge day for 39 Cincinnati police recruits earned after seven months of intense training that focused on de-escalating situations and a lot about connecting with community. This is something to be very proud of. You've earned this. 28 have college degrees, one has a master's, nine are parents, 12 have military experience. Joshua Jordan served two tours in Iraq. At heart, I'm a servant. Um, and I believe that's why I'm here on the surface to serve and no greater reward for me than to serve our community. Nine of these new police officers have family in the Cincinnati Police Department. The names go back generations. Halusik, Falachi, Kernachion, Dodson, Ward, Hine. Officer Emily Hine's mother, Sergeant Shannon Hine, pinned her father's badge on her. He's Sergeant John Hine. <laughs> Emily was inspired to become a police officer after the ambush killing of Officer Sonny Kim in 2015. I was just really thinking about how that truly is what it means to serve. I want to be part of this family and part of a job that I can put myself in any position that I need to for other people. For the Carney family, Joe is the fifth one in law enforcement. This is my father, Tim Carney. He was sergeant uh, with Cincinnati for 28 years. When he joined the uh, military, he says, I come from a family that serves. Now he's serving the city of Cincinnati. Yes. Savor this. Wear this badge with pride. There are many that came before you, many that have sacrificed their lives for this profession. Tomorrow, this class will be sworn in and officially become Cincinnati police officers. Deborah Dixon, Local 12 News. The new officers will work with field training officers for the next 13 weeks.